Hello everybody, welcome to my collective April haul that I'm filming in one day because I'm a nut. Actually, I probably will film this in multiple clips because I'm waiting on one more order and it says it'll be here today. But I'm going to film my sticker portion now, which is like a really healthy, chunky size. And that's like not even all of it because I got rid of some of the stuff that like I technically can't show. I'm going to do it like this foil bundles that haven't been released yet kits well one of these i could show april mystery but i also have may mystery nine year and the nine year mystery kit there's two different kits right i don't know there's a bunch those are all just gonna get put away because otherwise i'm gonna forget but anyways let's get started i have four sticker shops to share with you. The first is a brand new shop to me that I'm super stoked for. This is Plan With Me stickers. I have been seeing everybody talk about them and I was like planning on making an order and then I forgot. And then I saw everybody posting about the custom mini scripts and I was like, well, that's literally everything I've ever wanted in my entire life. So I placed an order with Plan With Me stickers. This is my first ever order. I'm super excited. I am gonna pull out my invoice off camera because it does have my address on it but the owner erica did write me a super sweet note saying that she threw in some extra customs which was very kind of her so this is the little oh it's strawberries journaling card here super cute and i do have some freebies i did put in the notes that i wanted to receive domi's freebie i feel like i'm gonna ask for a new person's like every time because all the freebies are so stinking cute so this is in like a sparkly hollow um like i said this is domi's freebie so she has a full box overlay that i'm obsessed with that says let the good times roll and then you have some scripts here game night plan read relax nap and tv time i felt like i was going to use all of this i'm actually just going to put it right here with all my freebies that i plan to use because that's right there. And then this is the All Orders March 2023 freebie, which is in like almost a matte bronze. This might even be matte bronze. I don't know. Obsessed with the full boxes. April showers bring May flowers. You are my sunshine on a rainy day. Again, I'm just going to slide it right here because just in case I need that. Then this is the March 2023 $35 plus order freebie, which are some silver full box overlays. It looks like raindrops, which is very sweet and pretty. I will save this i have a kit i think this could be good for i'm not using it yet though but i think i might just slide this in the back of the Coraline kit i think anyway so she had these like cute little mini mini scripts and i was like oh i need these oh i also didn't realize christmas mini customs that's so cute um i got font four and i got a bunch of them so the first one i got here is grocery pickup and then I got pack orders, which I think I got a couple of some of these. Yes, I got looks like two of pack orders, bed early, make wax, which I think I got a bunch of these as well. Hold on. I think I got like three or four of these. One, two, three, because I go through those really quickly. Cook dinner. And then these are the customs she made, which is like <sighs> adorable. I just got them in black. She does offer foil, but like I just, I just really. It's just so easy to, especially if you're trying out a shop for the first time, because like I didn't want to order all of these in every single foil, you know what I'm saying? Um, but anyway, she made with Brian, with Reagan, with Avery, and Family Time, which is like the sweetest thing on the whole freaking planet. And these are so cute. I love the way like their names look in the cursive. Like that's so pretty. That font is so pretty. So I'm like super excited to use these. I'm just going to add these to my stack that I already have going. But it was a good time good time ordering there's a lot of stuff in her shop she has like overlays underlays doodles all sorts of things so definitely check out her shop i'll link it below as i do i link everybody's but yeah this was my first order and i'm like very impressed i'm super excited and i've just been keeping an eye out on the new releases and seeing if there's anything i absolutely need she does have a like 30th birthday full box overlays and i'm like do i buy those now do i wait because it's only a year away so i don't know but these are amazing i'm just gonna add them to my stack right there because that's where those are then next up i have a couple of Polana hannah orders which i am so excited about Ugh, love her i've basically just been keeping a running cart and whenever i feel like my cart's too big i check out or just like when i need something i check out so that's how it's been i do have a code with hannah you can use the code fantasy 15 to save 15 percent and get my freebie which my new one is in one of these orders so i'll show you that when i get to it so here's my first order 
Here's the journaling card in that order. I'll add that to my stack. Um, okay, so this one has my old freebie, but that's a-okay. Actually, quite a bit of freebies. I felt bad with this order. I'll explain. So this was the March freebie because it was Chris's birthday. This is in her like sparkly pixie hollow. I have another one here. You can kind of see a little bit better. It says I went outside once the graphics weren't that good. Um, you have some scripts, play games, happy birthday, which that's actually perfect. A star, a heart, a smiley face, all in like pixelated and then a pixelated heart deco, which I love that. I'll just slide that in there. This was my old freebie, but again, it's still really useful. Still in that like sparkly pixie hollow, which I love it so much. I used to have the stroke box, morning coffee, work read in one of her font of the months that I was obsessed with. I think it was November, a book icon and a pretzel icon because I love pretzels. And then I don't know why I got these. I think these are more freebies. This is an SPC um, matte label sampler. And then I actually really like that this is in black the pixel deco because I feel like it's pretty useful. Again, I'll just slide that in there. So there's that. And then here's my order. <laughs> so here's the thing. I felt really bad, but like, no, oh, this is amazing. So, oh, I got so many. Oh, I felt so, I feel so bad. She came out with these new sparkle hole reinforcers and I love hole reinforcers. And sometimes you just need a fun color for hole reinforcers. You know what I mean? So I just went through and I was like, what are all the fun colors I mostly use? And that's kind of what I did. So I feel bad because she probably had to use so much foil for this or like pull so much foil, but like, I'm so excited. So I'm gonna try my hardest to tell you the colors of the foil, but if I mess up, I mess up. I think this is burgundy, uh, sparkly red, pixie red maybe. This is black. I did get black, go me, black. Light purple, yes, light purple. Is that another black? Did you just throw these in? Cause, or is this like in a dark green or something? Maybe it's like a dark green. Oh, I need, I'm like under studio lights, but I'm blinder than a bat. So maybe, I don't know. Um, mid purple or dark purple. I think it's mid purple. Ooh, this is pretty. Is this like, what is this? I don't know what this is. Is this coral? I don't know, it's really pretty though. Uh, mid blue. Red, regular red. I don't know, I'm not the, I'm not the one for this job. Lavender potentially. This is olive. Matte silver. Rainbow. Obsessed. Um light purple. Yeah, yeah. Lime. Love the lime. Uh copper or pumpkin. Couldn't tell you. Dark blue and light green. <laughs> Couldn't tell you them, but hey, I tried. And I'm just really happy to have these, honestly, because like <sighs> useful. One of these has gotta be like a dark green or something. Cause I'm like real blind. Maybe there's both black. I don't know. It works for me. Next up, I got the 2023. This is the large year and I picked Sparkly Hollow because I wanted to put this in my planner, my 2023 planner. Cause there's really no semblance, semblance. There's really no symbol showing like that it's 2023. So I was like, I'm going to put this in the front. And I, since I do two planners per year, it's nice to have these. So I got it in Sparkly Hollow cause that's kind of the theme that I guess I was going for. And then we got some underlays for kits. And I'm really excited. So the first ones I got here are Jungle. And I got it in both Lime and the like hot pink. Because I'm using this with the Birthday Queen kit. And I know you're like, Kristen, that's weird. No, the patterns in that kit, this is going to be amazing. So there's so many colors in that kit. You could realistically pick any colors. But I wanted to bring out the hot pink and the lime. So that's what I did for that one. I got Hands in Dark Purple. She talked about how somebody ordered this underlay to go with the Wednesday kit and I would have never put the two together and I got I just became obsessed with it. So Hands in Dark Purple for the Wednesday kit. Doggo 2 in Coral and Mid Blue. I felt like the Coral would match a little bit better but I don't know. This is for the Bluey kit. I don't know if you can tell. I just didn't want to do the orange but I felt like the Coral might be a little too pink but I think I'm still going to do it. So that's for the Bluey kit. Taco Love in Dark Green for the Austin kit. I got Dark Green because I really wanted to bring out Austin FC colors, but actually I'm obsessed with this. So Taco Love in Dark Green. And then Sprinkles in Rainbow for the Trolls kit, which I think is awesome. So those are my underlays. That was my first Planet Hannah order. Here's the second one. So excited. Okay, so... Here is the journaling card with this order. And then I got that same freebie, but got in like the light purple, which is so pretty. I did get an extra one of my old freebies, which I'm excited about in silver too, which is very useful. And then this is my new freebie. I'm obsessed. I think this is in her medium pink, mid pink. 
self-love club is the overlay which i'm obsessed with i have a laptop heart and book icon work with my love and read in font five obsessed so if you use the code fantasy 15 you'll save 15 percent and get that freebie my camera's dying give me a sec all right here's the rest of the order so i was getting real sick of having to write in um shows since i was running last of us and stuff every week and i'm like you know what i'm just gonna start getting them in scripts because it's so much easier and now i'm like should i start getting like her custom multi of all the books that i read because like that might be so much easier than writing it in too so anyway i started with house of the dragon which i got she had a sale specific font but it was game of thrones font so i was like okay i'm just gonna get house of the dragon we call it hot d so i got hot d in the game of thrones font in black and then i also got succession in font five i think because you know succession is amazing so got those two customs and then oh i've been seeing Samantha plans and reads and I think Hannah uses these too and I was like oh I kind of want to use these for my weekly like my weekly spreads so I got her days of the week in font five as well in light gold silver rose and hollow I'm excited to try using these I think it's gonna be really fun I love that there's one two three four five six sets so six weeks six times four 24 weeks right here worth which is like kind of nice so i got those in all the core four well light gold's not a core four foil colors to use in my weekly spreads and just a couple underlays this time around so i got bloom in her light purple is this mid purple maybe it's like it's light purple to go with the royal tea collection from spc oh and i love how like sat like there's so much and this is like so beautiful can you see so pretty i got damask 2 in silver to go i don't know the name of the kit it's like a blueberry spa day kind of kit from crest press i wanted to get damask and i was like searching 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 through all the foil colors and i'm like what well, foil color really matches this and i'm like kristen just get silver it it will, it'll be perfect so that's what i did and then i got groovy and coral to go with that, like uh, i just want to call it the avocado kit from crest press but this is so pretty too so those were my two plan of hand orders good stuff then i have a very small crest press order i just have one kit here to show you this is called lazy sundays yes lazy sundays super cute i'm like this is a really good like any time kit honestly so i went ahead and picked it up i did grab the brunette full box as an extra as well as the brunette like double box as an extra because i just kind of was obsessed with all of these i did also get the 15 millimeter washi strip that was weird and then this looks like it's the freebie extra boxes tiktok and cookies amazing um so this is the kit i actually really quite like it i like that there's books and coffee and tiktok and cookies and netflix and cats and cute little dogs cuddling and take out and ice cream and yeah this is just like a very relaxed sort of kit and i'm real into it so that's the full boxes here is the deco and extra boxes and such here i get the i think it's called the full kit it's like a step down from the ultimate but it works really well for the way i plan well there's like a kindle here oh and this like knitting so cute um yeah i just really thought this would be nice for like any time i have no specific plans to use this one quite yet like i really don't know where to slot this in this is just gonna go ahead and go in my like hoard essentially but i just wanted to have it because i thought it was really cute and you know if there's ever a week where i don't do anything which is quite unlike me usually um this would be perfect so i have that from crest press and then last but not least we have a beautiful hefty stack here from spc it's just my weekly what i bring home so this actually i think i brought home this week but let's go over it so i did bring home some of these black day covers because i was so excited that these had just come out and i think these are going to be perfect so i'm just going to add that to my date cover stack which is next to me i did bring home some doodles so i have number 700 which are the cute little bears 693 which is a bowl of salad 689 which is like a cute strawberry filled sheet i think this would be really cute to save for that strawberry birthday week and then 688 which is like a cute easter week or like easter doodles this is doodle number doodle of the week number 69 sheets 12 1 through 12 so this is 12 11 10 9 8 it's like a sparkly tangerine color it's very pretty three two 
single one. And then I did bring home the scribbler, number three. I love that sampler, so cute. I'm just gonna put it on the bottom. Love that. And then I did bring home the like scribblers of the week. So I have like little Peter Pan, a little Tinkerbell, and then the scribbler getting out of the shower or the bath or whatever, because I'm obsessed with those. Then my next little stack here. This is doodle number 67, which is like a really pretty deep purple, again with the scribblers. This is number 34, the eye roll. I think those are so cute, as well as Mickey and Minnie. And then I did bring home four of the grid in black. Obsessed. Have that. Next little pack here. <laughs> oh, so much good stuff being released. Okay, so first up I have the doodle color of the week, which was color number 68, which is like the most beautiful, sparkly, light purple imaginable. And I think I have scribbler number four because three had sold out and I didn't feel like printing and cutting a whole sheet for myself. And then I do have scribbler number 35, which is with the packages. And then this was the week that the butterfly underlays were released. And I was like, oh, these are gorgeous. Like seriously, these are so pretty. Gold, silver, rose, hollow. The sparkly is just like a little intense. I'm kind of obsessed. Champagne lights. And then the matte bronze is gorgeous. So those are the butterfly underlays next pack all right so this was the week number 66 the bright yellow which is going to be so good for summer spreads i wonder if this matches that new kittenish dress art i'll have to obviously when that gets printed and cut check it out but the bright yellow scribbler number 33 with the headphones and then of course 64 guy Fieri. amazing this was the week that the grid like oh i already have four of these poo I'm taking these back to work. I don't need eight. Um, this was the week that the grid in the like core foils was released. So I wonder if it was stripe I meant to grab. I don't remember. Um, oh, these are so pretty. I just love how like solid these are. They're so nice. And then the last one, at least I have two kits to share with you. The first is the full house kit, which I'm obsessed with. I'm going to slot this in for the summer when I have like a week that is so busy. Because like there's so many full boxes that need to be used. For example, full box sheet one, full box sheet two. Like, I could do two spreads with this. Or I could, I guess, just knock out some of these characters. But, like, come on. And then, of course, I have the doodles. Love the doodles. Tall box is the house. And then, look at this. I'm just obsessed. Oh, this is so cute. I just love that she does this, too. I'm obsessed. I have to figure out a way to use those. Ah, oh, what am I going to do? There's so many. Oh, I just love the patterns, too. So many good full box options. Like it's gonna be so rough. Like not sure how I'm gonna choose on that. So that is the full house kit. Ugh. And then last but certainly not least, at least for the sticker portion, because I do have a wax portion as well from SPC. I have the Mario kit, which are we saving this for Bennett's birthday? Andre, let me know because I absolutely will. But oh my god, Reagan is obsessed with Mario now too. Y'all. You want to take a gander who Regan's favorite is? You want to take a gander? It's Bowser. My girl loves Bowser. And that makes me, like, cry laughing. It's so funny. She loves Bowser. She loves the Peaches song. But anyway, so with this kit, I did bring home the doodles, which are in, like, this amazing rainbow. Candyland, the Candyland kit has doodles that are in, like, a pastel rainbow. Even if you don't pick up that kit, you need that doodle set. It's so cute. Here is the freebie. This is so cute. I love Toad. I'm a toad stan. I love toad. So, oh, there's so much light. The colors are so bright and so fun. I'm obsessed, 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 obsessed with this kit. So, cannot wait to use this for hopefully somebody's birthday. Because it is going to be so good. Imagine the Planet Hannah checkered underlays in rainbow with this. It's going to be so perfect. So, that's it for the sticker portion. I'll see y'all in one second with the wax. Alrighty, and then to finish up this haul bit, I did just get in, quite possibly, I think it is, my biggest Sassy Girl Aroma order to date. This particular pre-order, I feel like it was just designed with me in mind. It really had to have been because every freaking scent was so good. Um, I got way too much, way too much. I actually got two freebies, which I'm really excited about. So these are both shot cups, like tiny shot cups. The first one is in Comfort. Um, kind of just smells like, like a very soft, warm, 
like laundry boom boom kind of cream kind of smell quite nice do like that one and then the other one here is crayon apple marmalade which this smells like christmas it smells like potpourri i like that too um so i guess we'll get started with the loaves i got three loaves you guys oh, they just all sounded so good um her loaves are tinless and there's chunks everywhere when you cut these you definitely have to make sure to warm them up before you do so otherwise they are a crumbly crumbly mess but i'm so excited this first one is called a psychiatric ward i have seen both hannah and andrea rave about this and i was like i need to try it this is butter cookies with blackberry and strawberry jam so i'm assuming like blackberry jam butter cookie strawberry jam butter cookie vanilla bean noel donuts and zucchini that sounds amazing here i'll pull this whole loaf out maybe just to show you guys i mean they're huge and they're so beautiful yeah this was like blackberry jam butter cookies and zucchini bread it's so good i love it so much blackberry jam butter cookies has easily become one of my favorite oils in 2023 i am just oh so obsessed with it so that is the first loaf that i got the next loaf that i got here is called Garcia's Coffee. I have seen the Garcia blend before and oh sorry if I went out of focus and I've been wanting to try it and this was the only like option in this pre-order so I was like you know what I like coffee it's fine. So it's sugar cookie birthday cake fresh brewed coffee and zucchini bread. Mm, this is fantastic. The coffee in this is so good. It smells so like it's not a super bitter espresso coffee. It's a very like bakery almost style coffee to me, like bake shop. I'm not really smelling much birthday cake. I didn't expect to, but it mostly to me just smells like the fresh brewed coffee and like a hint of that zucchini bread, which I'm so here for. So I love this one. And then the last loaf that I got is called Three Ring Circus, which is salted caramel, pretzel, vanilla butter fudge, hazelnut cream, and doughboy bakery. Vanilla butter fudge is another scent note that I have just become entranced by honestly it's so good so that was salted caramel and pretzel and like a bakery blend please mm, this is everything it's very pretzel forward you can definitely smell the vanilla vanilla butter fudge but yeah that pretzel is a shining star in this that is so good so that is three ring circus and those are the three like oof, loaves that i bought i'm gonna have to move these out of the way because the amount of brittles that I purchased is ridiculous, ridiculous, ridiculous. So here's my like gorgeous brittle stack. Oh, she's so beautiful. And we'll just go down the line. So up first we have Harry Potter. This is tea and cakes, blackberry butter and jam cookies. Again, I think that's blackberry jam butter cookies. Vanilla sugar waffle cone. So tea and cakes, blackberry jam butter cookies and vanilla sugar waffle cone. She's super pretty. Once again, all I'm getting is blackberry jam butter cookies, but that tea and cakes mixed with that is so good. Yeah, now I'm getting the tea and cakes. Like, you get hit right away with the blackberry jam butter cookies, but then tea and cakes definitely takes over. I'm not smelling any vanilla sugar waffle cone. Again, I didn't really expect to. It's such a good, like, light base note. That's fantastic. Am I out of focus again? Quite possibly. Next up. Yeah? Yeah. There we go. Uh, we have Haunting. I love the colors in this. This is a Booberry, Wildberry Mousse, a Zucchini Bread, and Vanilla Bean Noel. Huge fan of the Booberry fragrance oil. It is so delish. Mm. And this is so good. This is a very berry Zucchini Bread. Hint of van Vanilla Bean Noel. This is so good. I would definitely consider purchasing this in a loaf. That is fantastic. This one I've seen for a really long time. And I always wanted to get it. It's like a G6. I freaking love that song. That song came out when I was a sophomore in high school. Um, this is caramel vanilla pound cake cornbread muffins. Mm. I just love bakery. I just love cornbread. I just love caramel. Oh, that is so delicious. I love that one so much. 
This one's kind of an oddball for like if you think about my order. This one I wasn't originally going to get. It's beautiful. But here's the thing. So this is, I think it's Montego Bay. Blackberry, Beach Night, and Marshmallow. I am obsessed with Sassy Girl Aroma's Beach Night. I think it is so good. I just, I love it so much. And then I love Blackberry. It's so refreshing and bright. And then Marshmallow is such a, such a great scent as well. And this is fantastic. Her Beach Night is so good. The Blackberry is so bright and like I said, refreshing. The marshmallow is a base note, so like I'm sure it'll make everything more creamy and delicious and fluffy, but this is so gorgeous and that smells amazing. You know, I gotta break up my, um, what's it called? My bakery love and heart here. Next we have Pistachio in the Kitchen. This is Pistachio and then the In the Kitchen is Cookies, Twinkies, Birthday Cake, Vanilla Fudge, Butter, and Marshmallow. This is very, if I remember from smelling it yesterday, Yes, this is very pistachio forward. Like pistachio is such an intense scent and oil. It smells it smells just like pistachio. I don't smell anything else, but I mean, I liked it and I knew I would like it. So, I definitely wanted to give that a try. This one I've melted before and was obsessed. This is out of the bread box. I think I might have one more of these. I'm not 100%, but this, I had to get it. It's such a good, such a good scent. This is pretzel, caramel, coffee, and vanilla bean Noel. Oh, yes, this is so good. I just remember every time I melted this, that like week or two weeks that I had this bar, being obsessed with it. It's just so delicious and wonderful. I love that one so much. That's definitely a fave. Next one is Audrey May in the kitchen. Strawberry pound cake. Oh, and in the kitchen, like I said, is another... Is her blend so this is strawberry pound cake is audrey may i think and then yes cookies twinkies birthday cake vanilla but fudge butter and marshmallow so in the kitchen is like a house blend and then she just adds various things to it so this one has the strawberry pound cake and that one's the pistachio and yeah this is really good this one actually i do think i'm getting that in the kitchen blend a little bit more like i can definitely smell the strawberry but i am getting the vanilla fudge vanilla butter fudge marshmallow birthday twinkie yeah, it's very good. I actually quite like that one a lot more kind of just because I feel like I'm getting more of the scent notes But of course on warm these could all be completely different and then last but not least I got Bob Jones I have heard summer Michelle here on YouTube talk about Bob Jones, which I love the colors of these um, So much and I was like, oh my gosh, I need to give it a try This is brown sugar zucchini bread and old town bake shop three incredible scent notes And this is so good. This is heavy bakery delicious Oh, that zucchini bread is so warm. I love this one so much. So I definitely wanted to give that a try. And I will say all of my stuff was packaged like so beautifully. None of the brittles cracked. Obviously, like none of the loaves have cracked. Everything was perfect. So that is my massive Sassy Girl Aroma order. And that's going to be it for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.